Adam Newman, the founder of WeWork, ousted from the company in 2019, might now be trying to buy it back. Dear Drabosa has some exclusive reporting for today's Tech Check. I can't wait to hear this one day. You know, Courtney, this story will never not be interesting, and it might never end either. Here is the latest. Adam Newman's lawyers, they sent WeWork a letter last night saying that Newman's latest venture, a real estate company called Flow Global, and suggesting that it had financing support from Dan Loeb's hedge fund Third Point for a bid. But he said that the letter says that Newman is being shut down by WeWork itself. Quickly, though, there was another twist. I called up Third Point, and they told me that the meeting was very preliminary. Another source familiar told me that, in fact, it was just one meeting last fall between Loeb and Newman, and there were SoftBank executives there, but that Third Point hasn't made any commitment, which... Courtney, could mean that the chances of a Newman return aren't exactly imminent, but I have a feeling this doesn't mean that the saga's over. I can you make it make sense, Deirdre, okay? I, I mean, I can't. The guy, the guy, listen, I, I, I've read books and podcasts about him. He's like a cult of personality. Like, I get it, but I don't get it. Help. Yeah. I, you know, okay, let me try and help. Okay. So... We work as a company, I mean, it's the poster child of the zero interest rate era, right? When SoftBank came in, they gave Adam Newman billions and billions of dollars and said, grow faster, don't worry about losing money. And that's exactly what he did. I know we work from the early days, and I understand why Adam Newman has his fans. I understand how Andreessen Horowitz poured hundreds of millions of dollars into his new venture because he is extremely charismatic and he did build something that was very compelling and interesting, which is the co-working space. It just really got out of hand, and you could argue it wasn't a very good business model to begin with. His new venture called Flow buys up real estate. So you wouldn't have the same problem, the same business model fiasco of WeWork, long-term leases, renting out for the short term. It was never going to work. So this could be an interesting idea, but again, it kind of just undermines it because the letter from the lawyers implied that Dan Loeb was committed to sort of a bid, and that just wasn't the case. I, I'm just saying that's what the letter kind of implied, and it turns out that that wasn't it. So I don't know. I don't know who's <sighs> going to help Newman finance this thing. I don't know what the future is. What I'm saying is that um, many people still use WeWork. It's a great office space. Does it? What does it look like in its next iteration? I do know there's people who would like to see Newman go back. I just don't know if that's a realistic possibility. Wow. Mm. It's just wild. It's wild I stuff. feel like I've talked myself in circles again. I, I was, I, I, Brian and I were just looking at each other like, do you have any questions? Yeah, I have a lot of questions, but I think we're out of time. <laughs> Dee, thank you so much. Keep following this for us. Will do.